Hello guys, welcome back to Clash of Clans episode 2. So, if you haven't seen the first episode, I highly suggest watching it before watching this one. In this episode, we are going to be transforming our small puny base into something that's somewhat respectable. But that all starts from here. We have to start upgrading and fast because we only have around one week to make a fully maxed Town Hall 4 base. And right now, we are in the middle of Town Hall 3, so we have to get some progress going. Alright, I'm just gonna upgrade all these walls. And we can't do any more. Actually, yes we can. Alright, it looks like I can't claim any more gold, so I think I'm just gonna upgrade something else. Let's go on an attack. I think I'm gonna go Mega Blaster. Let's go... So let's go... This one. This one's also pretty easy, it's just the same one as last time. We lost. I haven't gotten any requests from my clan yet, but it's only been like the first day since uploading the video, so. Another thing is that we are getting pretty close to um, our third builder, so that will be nice once we get it. Kind of make things going a little faster. To finish out this day, I also upgraded a few of our buildings. Alright guys, so we just got Town Hall 4, so we can build the boat now. The first thing I think I'm going to want to get done is I'm going to upgrade our laboratory. The boat. Speed. Speed. Let's go. Wow, the builder base. This is the only reason I'm here. Level 2. So I'm going to do builder barracks. First, do that. What other thing should we upgrade? We should probably upgrade our barracks, but it costs way too much. Wait. Ah, it's not enough. There we go. This should be good. Yes, so now we can upgrade our barracks. Because we want the balloon. The most OP troop in this entire arena. Practice. Oh, yes. So much resources. Alright, let's do our first practice match. Shield for the wall breakers. This is the easiest. Alright, that was really easy and it gave us a ton of loot. Third Builder's Hut, let's go! Okay, so some stuff that you guys should know is that my file corrupted for day three, but I can tell you that I did a lot of builder based stuff, upgraded that layout, and then I also um, got into a new clan because someone sent me a request. I don't know who it was, so if you're a viewer, then you can put it in the comments. base design time okay so for this kind of base design i made it so that it is very fortified with all the defenses in the middle and everything on the outside as well as all the defenses able to reach all the outsides on the other hand for the billy race i kind of just threw a bunch of stuff together and hoped it worked i then finished out the day by upgrading some stuff 
So in this day, I upgraded a few things, and then I built the gym mine. Put simply, I just didn't have the video. I'm gonna upgrade stuff overnight, five hours, sure. So, what else could we upgrade? Four hours, sure. I really like this design, because see how it, if they like place a troop like here, like right outside of these two walls, this archer tower can hit it, the motor can hit it, like every single part of the defense is kind of just protected. And we're gonna upgrade all of our walls right now. Let's just do full school. A few giants of tank right on that. A few giants of tank, archers right on that. Now we just spam some balloons on this side. Let's go. Now we just got three stars on that. Look at all those troops expended. I'm going in the little elixir storage. Alright guys, so it is day 7, the final day. And we only have three more upgrades to do before we are officially done. Let's get going on our town hall. Now I'm gonna upgrade this archer tower to four treasury, collect all those, and then I can upgrade my cannon. That will take an hour. Some things that I would like to say as I'm wrapping up this video is that I did find a clan of you or did send me it, I think, but they haven't put it in like the comments or anything, so I don't really know. Until then, though, I will see you later.